yeah, if you got AOE, swarms are no big deal, usually. That's why it's always nice to have a kineticist. Oh, yeah. All right, I've started the recording, so stop saying weird, awkward shit. Weird, awkward shit. Thank awkward, you. weird shit. I spit on you, soup bitch. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good start. That's a perfect start to it. To the Iron God session. Let's see. I'm going to put this on so nobody does anything funky. And then we're going to go back to this beautiful battle scene and try to refresh our memories of what the hell we were doing. Killing everybody. Yeah. Uh, vision enabled. Tim, are you able to see through a Kraden okay? I'm making sure I haven't selected no. Uh, it's all dark. Up here? Yeah. It's all dark. The whole screen's dark. Uh, I can refresh. No, 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 no. I think you need a new token. One sec. Uh, you are. You are set to be his owner. And his initiative is. Dude, did I roll piss poop for him? Where is he? Uh, okay. He might just not be in the list. Can no, he's there. Him? He's 10. He's 10. Okay. I see him. Hey, Toby? Okay. Yeah. The pop out mod's broken again. God damn it. Not pop important out. right now. Just letting you know. Pop out mod, you son of a bitch. I can, I can survive without it. Okay, Akraden has rolled way better initiative, so now I have to fix it. I still can't see. I'm on refresh. Okay. Let's see. I need to select you. You. You two. Okay, that'll do. Yeah, I'm not sure why you can't see. Let's take a look at him. Vision enabled. Vision. And he should have dork vision, so he doesn't need a light spell. He do have that dork vision. Okay. Ooh. Now I, I can see. I see I have I some... penetrate your train of zombies with my wall of thorns. Wow. Eh, it didn't sound how I wanted it. All right, I'm done. I'm not going to play with it anymore. <laughs> so he says. You all heard him say it, right? That's what yeah. most of the Carrying Crowns party said Make for will three save. hours. Okay. Yeah. For the next three hours. Make will, will save. save. Giant, you have no idea. <laughs> it's the biggest will save you've ever seen. I don't know. Olfred's right over there. I do have a pretty high will save. All right, <clears throat> so I'm pretty sure we should start with the bad guy turn. Uh, yep. No, oh. my music, my music <clears throat> played. I get to go. That's true. Your music did play, and I forget whose turn it actually is. So I think it is your turn. And let's review where you are. You are half okay. dead. I am half dead. Yeah, you have a technically trooper ten foot south of you, with Luna. 20 foot south of you, fighting a gearsman who's 30 foot south of you and around a corner. Down the western hallway, you see Ulfred, who is pretty wounded, but still in good shape. He's a tough guy. He is man-fighting one of those weird Borg things, toe-to-toe. -to -toe. You're pretty sure around the corner, around that corner to the north, is Tokala, as you can hear the chainsaw and the yelling. You think Nomcath and Croctaw went that way to the north, but you have not seen them in several rounds. Chaos is happening. The party has employed the Big Bang Theory of combat where everyone explodes outward from the center. And speaking of, there was a huge explosion from that direction not long ago. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I, blew, I, I tossed some Silex and then blew that's up right. all, all the stations. You found the control room, the, the center of Tech League surveillance in Starfall. They have other equipment rooms, but this one was their primary spot for 
spying on the populace, spying on each other, spying on the barbarians. And Namketh opened the door, saw tens and tens of thousands of gold worth of electronic equipment, and C4'd it immediately. That was equipment that was being used to target us. Oh, yeah. By, with spells. No, I'm, I mean, I'm saying, you now, pretty sure you now have the record for property damage. You just took it from <laughs> Tokala with one shot. Oh, shit. That's a good thing I looked through my list, bros. Yeah? Uh, I forgot I had a big dick quick stick. Okay, um... Um, <clears throat> excuse me, how... I do. I haven't used it today. I've used my peerless speed, but not it. Um, uh, so there's one guy uh, that I can target currently. Yeah. How what is he? Uh, uh, one sec, and I will tell you. He is... He does not look like he has been particularly pummeled yet. Um, let's see this. Oh, that's why. That's why. Okay. Uh, and am I in fizz or negative? Uh, one sec. I should give you a current, like, buff check. Wouldn't yeah, you please do. Yeah. I can't see you when I click on my token, so I think you're in fizz. Wow. I agree. I like the way he thinks. Well, I have line of Is sight that... to you. you. Well, <laughs> All right, let's see. Fix this. Good. That's there. That's there. That's there. You have, you maniac, super bless, fly, uh, hidden, spot and hidden. We're going to take those off because those are from that mod. I meant to mm. disable that mod. We don't need those. Haste, you are hasted, and you're connected to Castnet, and you have Pro Fire that has not been uh, depleted at all yet. Hmm. I'm not in Viz, so he can see me. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, 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 yeah. Oh, fuck. Um, He's one of their that. lower level troopers, but still potentially dangerous. You see that he's wielding a, a long chain weapon that has seven great axes on the end of it? Oh, good God. It does times 21 on a crit. 1d2 of damage. Of course. Yeah. Seems legit. <clears throat> no weirder than the space bomb. Okay, so... Um, he's the only target, and all my allies are on the corner? I'm by myself? Rye, uh, Luna, is 20 feet south of you. Luna's on the other side of him. She will probably chop him into giblets on her turn, which is right after you. Okay. Uh, how close to me is he? Like, is he, could he charge me and kill me? feet south, not before her turn. In fact, uh, since he's not here, I'm willing to tell you through Castnet that Luna says she's going to five-foot hop and full attack him. Okay, then I will... move away from him okay and i have a cure mod on my sheet i have two of them would you click one on me please you're gonna do what again uh cure mod i have a cure mod yeah you do potion of cure mod okay oh it rolled a 14 i've applied it to you you now have 105 out of 170 hp okay thank you mm-hmm and you want to move back towards Ulfred, away from that dude? Yes. Okay. You're 15 feet behind Ulfred. You are now 25 feet away from that guy. Anything else you'd like to do? Did you want a big dick quick stick anything? No. Okay. <laughs> Haste is on, full attack. Um, just want to add in while we're doing Luna's turn, since you don't have enough things going on, I believe the Crodden's initiative should be 10 uh, to our convenience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you able to update his initiative? 
Can you oh, right, fuck. I never knew you, players could I don't do know if you can or not. Can you right-click on him in the turn check and say update combatant? Uh, let me try both places. No, I cannot. Okay. okay. And he should be a 10. Yes, sir. Oh, holy God. shit. Luna steps take... over, crits for 90. Oh. Hits for 60. He's super dead. She, in her rage, hits him again for 90. And then there's nothing <laughs> left of him, and she slams her cold hearted iron sword into the floor, cutting a huge gouge in the hardened steel floor and wall. Nice. And she, she uh, that's her turn. Huge. She heals or does some weird shit on her turn, too? Yeah, I noticed that just clicking her turn, the mod healed her like nine HP for her turn. Nice. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so her self healing shit is ticking. Okay, this guy is going to shoot Tokala. I shoot him. Uh, due to deadly aim. Dude, I he hate those guys. Shoots to call off at 38. Sometimes I wonder which one will be your last lie. A Crodden and his troopers need to roll uh, will saves. DC 21. Oh, I fail. Uh. Let's see. One trooper saves. <laughs> yep. Uh, you may roll a. Let's see. Does he have it? Yeah. Damn. That was a real good whole person she dropped. Let's see. Well, thanks for coming to the session, Tim. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah, it's great. So this trooper made it somehow. You failed somehow. Yeah, you rolled a nine. Um, this trooper fails. Let's see, where is it? Paralyzed. Tech bar, paralyzed. Tech bar, paralyzed. Okay. Pretty good spell by her. I think she just paralyzed like 40 levels of fighter. Bap. Bap. Okay. Five foot hop here. My super duper gunslinger. Deadly aim. He's not hasted. He rapid shots. He point blanks. He double crits. Miss. Luna takes 75. That misses. Luna takes 80. Luna still has 120 health. Jesus Christ. Ridiculous. <laughs> He lights her up. Olbrin, you actually hear her yell out in pain. That is the hardest she's been hit in one round for quite a while. Um, you hear her being just lit up by gunfire. Let's see. This guy... Enrique, do you remember what they have to do to get through your bullshit? It's a strength check. I yeah, let me repost it. Yeah, would you please? I want to say it's a strength check. Oh, uh, strength check 20. I'm pretty sure he rips it all down with that. Hey, all right. Yo. Hey, bud. Timing. Luna's about dead. I just shot you for 170. Welcome to the session. Lovely. To be fair, before you just hit someone for 200 right before that. Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah. When you get in, just scroll up and you'll see some nutso crits from your fighter. So far, the crits are flying tonight. Yeah. Foundry's been bored for weeks and weeks, and it's going to kill you all. Okay, piercing damage. Oh, yeah. AC. I think they have to just 
hack through it. Okay. You can make a strength check as a full round he action did. to force their way through it. So he goes five feet. Congrats to him. Amazing. Okay, so... I had a quick question. How many rounds have passed? Uh, we are like three turns in. We have been fucking around really, really It's a question if you're remembering about my fast healing. Oh, it did tick. Your turn just happened and it healed you for 18. And then I shot you for 200 almost. But you were almost at full. So yeah, it's going great. Everybody loves it. Nomcaf, up to some shit. What you doing? Yeah. Uh, can't quite flank, unfortunately. All right, give me a moment here. I gotta reconfigure some settings. You're good. You just had your turn. It's gonna be probably like ten minutes before it's your turn again. You know what? I'll go for others. I'll, I'll do that anyways. Go for the attacks. Okay. Open to flank. Well, there's business, but I just woke up. It happens. Back so I can do some extra damage. Obviously, I'm uh, attacking this cyborg. Horrible, horrible, holy crap. Five That's goals. a lot of single digits. Ooh, miss, miss, uh, miss, miss, hit. Thanks to that haste swing. You hit the one time. Uh, Dead Slayer, no, you're not using the gun, so, yeah. Okay, that's it. Yeah, I don't know why I get, I, I get this. This comes up on mine. Yeah, they shouldn't do that, but oh well. Draw the cat eyes sharp enough to kill a man. All right. Uh... Tokala and Nomcath and Ulfred. Make me a DC 20 reflex save. Fucking <laughs> Tokala, what the fuck? I think I just missed, um, I think I just made it because of my racial. Yes, you did. So you take half, and then if you have any, if you have pro electricity up, some of you might. Uh, I, I kind of, with, with those two rolls, I, I kind of see what happens with this is, uh, 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 Nomcat's fur starts bristling from the from the almost charge, and he looks over at uh, uh, Tokala and makes just a quick duck sign in <laughs> in, in sign language as he as he kind of uh, jumps up and backflips over over the bolt that comes in. <laughs> yeah, you see Tokala make an amazing save on on his own too. He like braces against the wall and dissipates some of the charge into the structure. Very disappointed tech trickster. Contact confirmed. This Borg is going to punch your head off. Little cat man. Little cat boy. Have one of these. Natural one. Holy shit, that's so much damage if they hit. Yeah, they're Magus. They're a Magus, so they spell, stack, or, uh, spell strike. This trooper is like, man, I hate being whole personed. Wait, uh, I see that Homeboy has Globe of Vulnerability Greater up, but that only extends to 4th level spells. Yep, unfortunately, Hold Person Greater is... Is a 7th level spell. Oh, shit. The thing. Yeah, 7th, yep. Okay, I wasn't sure if it functioned as he, regular however, Hold Person for that. makes his Hold Person save and breaks up. And that is his round. Nice one. This Draugr. Still trying to get through Croctaz's bullshit. Does not make any progress. This caster. Uh... Yeah. Uh, that's annoying. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, he's going to do this. Put a fireball right behind a crowd. You don't get to make a reflex save while you're held, do you? Nope. You just take full, bitch. Ow. These two do, because your two lowest level troops have made their saves and are not held. And then this one takes half. Why, well, I took them with me. They're the best there is. Yeah, they're the best. You're the best. Your style is unorthodox, but effective. You can roll a new will huh. save and fail. fail. Yeah. This character can't roll above a 10. Nope. He can't do Never it. Never seen him do it. He can't. This Draugr. Oh, fuck you, Croctar. Powering through it. You son of a bitch. No, I don't like that sound. Fails. Tech Barb. I I bonk this boy. <laughs> Ooh. His AC. That is a hit. A hit. A hit. With a terrible roll. Good job. You tore him up. He's still on his feet only because these Borgs are ridiculously tough. But you have practically dismantled him in one turn. Noise. Noise. This guy is busted out of his whole person. He five foots closer so that anybody... Oh, God. How fucking smart are you? Tactical average. He steps here, thinking that Osman might coup de gras. The barbarians. He valiantly walks forward, fighting defensively, and stands next to the head of the Technic League to prevent him from coup de gras. He was not going to coup de gras. <laughs> you know what? We're going to do a split. You're going to go. Uh. Bane. Haste. And this little piggy, you can enjoy 66 and die, and then he five foot hops. And that crit confirms for a hundred, and then he saws, whoops, saws himself in half. Let me fix that. Saws this Borg in half right in front of Ilford. You get covered in uh, motor oil and blood and guts. Nice. And he spends the last uh, swing that he didn't get to do. Flexing, mainly for Ulfred. <laughs> Spends a big dick swinging. That's right. You son of a bitch. Oh, please make your will save, sir. Nope. Fuck nope. you. Yep. It's still on the tracker? Yeah. Just stomping around a couple rooms away. <laughs> <laughs> Can't get here because the hallway's too small. <laughs> I was only down here for maintenance. If you guys had gone into that room, though, you'd be sorry. <laughs> Stomping your asses. All right, uh, Krafta's gonna pick up some of the tiles from the floor and fling them at people, uh, trying to hit the Watcher first. And if she kills him, then she'll direct the remainder at the Draugr. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah, that's real good. Bam! You instantly <laughs> knock the Watcher back off its feet. Sweet. Uh, these things have garbage AC for touch, so that's a hit. That's a hit. Yeah, the other two pelt this other warrior. He is a big okay. zombie, though. You're thinking like 200 HP. He barely took any damage Ooh. from those. Okay, yeah, and then I'll just move retreat. Okay. This Hellcaster... Hmm. Wizard coup de gras on Barb. He's dead, so he might be able to resist the temptation of wizard coup de gras. <laughs> he can't. He'll provoke an AOO from this soldier. I'd take it if he was a champ. Yeah, he should. Chad's provoke. Chad's do provoke. We know this. Aye. This is an established fact. 
Enjoy another fireball you can't save against. Yeah, um... This guy actually gets to roll a save. He makes it exactly and takes half. Troopers are really holding it down, man. It's kind of amazing. They usually are just the shittiest thing on the field for the TL. Okay, I will now easily rip out... <clears throat> More thorns. Okay. Well, this will be ugly. This barb auto hit. This barb auto hit. He just starts carving into this hold person barb. Not coup de grauing, just full swinging. And then his last swing goes all the way through the barb's midsection, cuts him fully in half, and slashes into the Technic League trooper for 35. And the Void Dragon. I forgot about the Void Dragon. Basically does the same thing to your other held barb. He is hit, hit, hit. And she then void bites. And he takes all of that. She is just tearing him apart. Meanwhile, this Roomba scoots over here. The Roombas on the tracker? Yes. <laughs> I would normally remove them, but Tokala, like, so valued their con contribution to every combat, mainly that he would stomp them on his way through to kill other things, that I've just learned to keep him in. Why not? Just some Tokala Speaking insanity. Speaking crucial Roomba, combat, is your sorry. Roomba going? Is it? Uh, it's, there's something going on in the background. I can't tell who it's coming from, though. Okay, I shut my door. Hopefully that'll keep it out of here. Let me know. I, you'll hear it before I do, because these headphones, so let me know if it comes in. Okay. Um, the scout steps here. Coup de gras Barbarian. That will crit, and he will have to make a ridiculous save. Which he rolls a natural one. He's dead. You well. see, you see this uh, Draugr, this risen scout, step up to him and stab him straight up through the bottom of the head into the skull. He's gone. Some steps forward to kill your um, trooper here. Trooper has respectable. That does almost nothing. It it's it cuts him, but not bad. They're nothing without their sneak attack. That one fails to move. That one rolls a natural 20, comes stomping out of the thorn wall. Where's that fucking dude? Cassandra okay. reports to you, Olbrin, uh -huh. that Akradin and his soldiers are being killed by Osman in the North Hall. Okay, can I get to them uh i don't know if you want to she says they're right next to osman and he's just cutting people to pieces okay she says akradin is exactly 145 feet northwest of your current position she says you could save him but probably not his soldiers. There's only two left alive anyway. Hmm. Guys, or, do you want me to save a Crodden? We don't know where he is exactly. We you know, we just we don't and we don't know what's between between us and him. Well we know that there's a ton of zombies in the thorn wall. I would have told no. you with that. <clears throat> Uh, I'm saying I can save him. He's Currently, just I can. If you want him to. At what risk to yourself? None. 
Okay. If it's no risk to yourself, then do it. Fucking time wizard. Okay, Toby, mm -hmm. I shift and grab him and then rewind back. That will use all of my shift, but I do it. Okay. You guys see Olbrin disappear. Right um, into an explosion. Well, that's not actually there anymore. And... <clears throat> Olbrin, when you appear, you see that there is a Technic League trooper directly south of you, a Karadin directly west, and another Technic League trooper to your immediate east who is being torn to pieces by Osman, the head of the Technic League. And you can shift out from here. Or What do I, what do I notice about Osman in the brief second I'm existing in that space? He is floating off the ground. You can uh, roll me a spellcraft check, too, I think would be appropriate. Okay. Oof. He is wielding a blade that appears to be made completely of light. His arms and legs appear to be full cybernetic replacements. They are some strange black metal that looks beyond even normal Glaukite alloy. He has a glowing triangular symbol in his chest, and his head looks he looks like a normal bald human with a long black cape flowing off of him. And he is calmly, with a very dispassionate look on his face, murdering barbarians, technically uh, barbarians that were formerly his soldiers. Looks like he's cut two of them in half. And where they've been cut in half, you see that the blade is just so hot and so powerful they, um, they're not even bleeding. The wounds are just cauterized shut. You're pretty sure it okay. hits on touch for a truckload. And he is, let's see, 23 spellcraft. You definitely see uh, flight, haste, shield, probably shield of faith, and some other shenanigans going on him. Uh, his weapon, can it, is it doing fire damage, electrical damage, or can I tell? Uh, roll me a heal check. Do you have the heal skill? Uh, I'll let your spell card count. It's fine. Ooh! Two. <laughs> you don't know shit. But it appears to be... It's not actually... It is, like, cauterizing the wounds shut partially, but it's mostly just cutting through them. Slashing. Okay. So I'm not convinced that any kind of energy resistance fire or electricity would do... Much you help there? You don't think so. Um, don't think so. Okay. The only weapon that is more capable of defeating DR is the space bone. <laughs> <laughs> well, it exists in multiple realities all at the same time. Yeah, let's, not, let's like not get into time. It. Let's shut per millisecond. Shut your flux capacitor. <laughs> and if you uh, you don't have any teleports left, do you? I do. You probably don't care, but you could save Akraden's two troopers. No, I'm not going to blow fifth level spells doing that. Okay. You grab him? I grab him, that's it. Akraden, you see one of your allies appear in a flash for a nanosecond. Do you resist the spell he casts on you? Uh, I'm held. I don't even know if I can, but no. It's a will save. You could. Oh, no, I don't. Okay. You are some kind of insta teleport. You really didn't. <laughs> you know exactly where you are. You're just south of the main Technic League Captain Conference Room. You see that there's battle all around you here, and the two soldiers that you just abandoned are almost certainly going to be butchered. So, wait a minute. Thanks. <laughs> my master plan before I failed a will save was to hop into the middle of all the troopers and then teleport all of us down here. Yeah. And uh, then I failed the will save, and so did everyone else, and now they're all yep. dead. Yep. That'll yep. happen. Uh, that's, is that all of my movement? Or all of my... It's your shift. Um, Which counts as a movement, I think, is what we said it did. Yeah, yours counts as movement. And then rewind. I don't think we ever really said what that counts as, if anything. Mm, 
I'm sure it counts, you big cheater. There's your rewind charge. Let's see. That's it, immediate. It's an immediate. So you've... Yeah, that's... I mean, it doesn't matter, but it only counts as an immediate action. Therefore, you've used your move and you're immediate. You still have a swift and a standard. And so it's swift and it's needed. Uh... Do we have macro for wands in this campaign? Burr. Why are you asking hard questions? <laughs> uh, yeah, it looks like you have wands. It looks like the uh, thing worked. Uh, yeah. uh, so how would I smack a Crowden with a wand of cure mod? Wand of cure mod, let's see. God, you have so many fucking wands. I'm a wand wizard. One of Cure Mod. Oh, it's got 50 charges. Okay. I clicked it. He could heal 14 if he wishes. Oh, doing, doing, doing the poop. Doing the poop rolls. That's your standard. What do you do with your swift? Um, I don't think anything. Okay. You can big dick take stick a spell if you wish. Uh, we're not all together, are we? Uh, Tokala is right next to Ulfred, which is right next to Akraden, next to you. Luna's around a corner out of sight. Nomkath and Krokta are around, around corners from you. Yeah, I really don't have anything that would help us. I could give us pro-energy electricity, but I don't know if it's really going to help us much. Yes, nay? There's still chain lightnings blasting away at Ulfred and Tokala. Yeah. We just took one. Okay, so... You could also just chain lightning, Ulfred. Just finish the job. <laughs> you could. Uh, I, I could. Uh, so that's four... What is it? Pro... Energy... Camille? Fuck. I don't... Our macro system takes no sense in my head. Hell yeah. Um, well, do you want to activate the big dick quick stick and do that? <sighs> Decisions, decisions. No, I don't. Okay. Okay. Bye. <laughs>50 points. And then the five foot step. Yeah. And go to town on the on, on this fucking... Oh, do you have your reach? <laughs> reach yeah, I, I, reach cool. I got my reach bullshit out. Nice. I do like reach bullshit. Ooh. That's going to confirm for... 72 he's super dead you can actually i'll refund you back the rest of your swings and you can do a normal move or a haste move you can move shitload hey, i guess so, kind of, so kind of like i guess so like five foot i, I guess would i guess a little bit find out what's on the or on the other corner you want to peek that corner huh you want to peek at the corner i think you should it's a great idea oh uh, <laughs> that's just she's a big guy Mm-hmm. He goes, nope. That's how I'm a little more, a little more, you know, a little more healed. Oh, Which come did. on. All right. That's Maybe fine. the juggernaut was readying an action? Oh, yeah. Oh. You're fine. You're fine. <laughs> oh, that's okay. I didn't even, I wouldn't even take the electric, the electric damage. Yeah, they would, uh, they would bash you. Move wherever you like. And that's, that's it. Fuck 
fucking shoot this stupid orc. Why won't you die? Takala gets blasted again. Alright, be right back. Alright. Uh, oh my god. Yeah, that would be a waste. That would be a waste. She's just gonna pick on you. She knows how crappy they are. That'll hit. That'll hit. That'll hit. Tech trooper down. Okay. Drug or thing. He attempts to get through Croctaw's bullshit. No! Alright. Question for future bullshit. This one. Yeah. The, the copycat wand. Yeah. If I, if I did it on one of these corpses, I would look like a corpse, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, that's what I thought. I was trying to think of, uh, I was trying to think of uh, some sneaky uh, uh, not invisible invisibility bullshit <laughs> oh you know copycat one of these guys so when Osmond shows up he thinks I'm on his side <laughs> well that's when, really funny then when Tokala fails his perception check he tries to chainsaw <laughs> you <laughs> you know All Tokala right, so... does not buy perception right you know that you yeah, know that know about that. him you know that he somehow has oh he has a buff on that's why okay actually I'm right tossing. now because the scrap witch has buffed him he has a 20 perception right now oh my god another side like oh. <laughs> well for a, make an engineer what the hell check. what the hell did you just do to him Kev? <laughs> Toss another Silex, because we got shit coming that way. We need to reconsolidate. I'm also trying to hit as many as I can. <laughs> Plus oh, five right competence on bonus. Plus five bonus on all competence. Engineering checks to identify uh, stonework, slopes, and structural subsidence problems. Ulfred, you <laughs> feel the entire rock shelf that this floor is built on tilt and crack somewhere across the middle. It sounds like the hugest tree in the world cracking straight through the trunk. Everyone else oh is like, god. oh my god, there's ex and you just feel like a minor tectonic plate shift underneath the, the floor as Nomcath is just repeatedly dropping <laughs> heavy <laughs> explosives in the same area over and over again, 30 feet it's underground. Only, it's only two. Monkey, 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 monkey. He I also, by default, even if it makes it saves, annihilates a Roomba. Oh! <laughs> and he can't collect the trophy. Yep. And actually, see that a uh, wall of thorns specifies that normal fire cannot harm it, so they should all be there. Yeah, they're. So, so that's good. They're. They, I mean, it gets blasted around, but it's magical thorns, so. It, Sweet. Yeah. Uh, okay. They rolled... Rubas don't have evasion? <laughs> well, they're all, like, trapped in thorns, too. Right? I would think they should be even yeah. harder. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I just meant the Roomba. They oh, failed. Roomba. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, they what's going on now? <laughs> Nomcath blew up a ball. Roomba. Why did you blow up a Roomba? The entire, the entire cave system is falling into the center of the Earth, but we got the Roomba. <laughs> A poor Roomba! Absolutely <laughs> thunderous explosion. You guys are in a metal tube 40 feet down the hall from C4. Your ears are ringing. It's a good thing we all know sign language. Oh. And for my movement, I charge the the trickster here. Okay. That was random. My computer just randomly shut off. I was going to say, who is, who is in and out? Oh, no. And I'm still trying to get back into the game. Okay. Okay. So you only there was only I thought I caught more than just that one Draugr Thane in, in that blast. Uh you did. Like, the others are up the hallway. There's okay. four others you can't see that you hit. And there was the two scouts. The, the scouts? Here. I don't oh, know. Okay, never mind. I just they weren't scouts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you hit six of them. Okay. I only saw the one roll, so mm -hmm. I guess you're, mm -hmm. you're doing a group roll. Yeah, I 
and no, that's I, fine. I, did, I didn't feel like rolling individually, and I made no them problem. all fail because of the fucking crock top bullshit. <laughs> -na 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 -na. All right, uh, and you ran all the way down here. Oh my god, you ran right at me. Yep. Well, she doesn't know that you have step up, so she five foots back. And I step up. <laughs> you little shit fucker. She rolls a concentration <laughs> check. Uh, twenty four. We'll eat this, Peckerwood. And, oh, man. Good thing Foundry keeps track of shit. I was about to cheat you and use impromptu sneak attack, but she has already spent it. She hits you with uh, one of these. Ooh. Looks like miss, and miss, miss, because your touch AC is very high. <laughs> exactly. Well, you do, some, you do some fucking Neo point blank with the agent shit, bending over backwards and stretching up and jumping up, touching the ceiling and coming back down, and she is like... She has just a look of what the fuck is happening on her face as all of this occurs. And I just give her a cat grin and, and, and show her my two daggers. <laughs> you ran up on her, you followed her on her five foot hop, forced her to make a concentration check, and then dodged three touch attacks. That's a pretty badass, pretty badass round right there, no cat. That's pretty good. You hit, plus, throw, plus throw in the super size grenade. Oh shit. <laughs> Level 14 Arcane Trickster, too. She is no slouch. Okay. Draugr Thanes. Let's see. There's C4 going off in our face. And I think I'll power through this thorn wall. Yeah. Risen Hellcaster. There is one little pitiful Timmy. Ooh. Right up here. Actually missed with one of her attacks. She shoots him Your in the back. Your style is unorthodox, but effective. I'm on route. Don't worry. Here it comes. I made it exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I am no longer held person. A Crodden comes out, finally able to speak, do anything other than move his eyes, looks at Olbrin and says, Thanks! You're fast as shit! <laughs> and that's his turn. That's his whole turn. I'm done that's now. That's his whole turn. Oh wait, no, no, actually. You could big I... dick quick stick a spell, believe mm -hmm. it or not. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm doing. And, uh, let's see, what do we get here? I was looking at this earlier. None of them looked amazing. Uh, Blink is not up for some reason. It's, yeah. You could put it up. Might as well. Let's see. And then we'll do displacement instead. We'll do the same thing. Fuck it. No, they don't, and Blink is better, but whatever. Oh. Nah, fuck it. Displacement is purely visual. Blink, you're actually not there some of the time. Oh, okay. Yeah, he would know that. We do Blink instead. He does. And he knows <clears throat> he suspects that Osmond would not be subject to displacement, but he could be affected by Blink. And don't forget to charge off your item. Yes, sir. Hmm. <laughs> Did you not click it? Oh, the big dick quick stick? Sorry, yeah. I mean the hot dog. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy <laughs> shit. Okay. <laughs> also, with a fancy new icon, the big dick quick stick. From Mid Journey. Not as cool as Space Bone. I know. I noticed that when I, when I attack with my with uh, cold hearted cold hearted iron, it was there was a new icon. Yep. <clears throat> cone to cone. Ulfred has his foundry reloaded. Uh huh. Hell yeah. PJ. Oh, I, I showed I was next, but okay. Looks like we're all down pretty far, so I'm gonna throw out a channel. Okay. Could head basically all of that. Okay, I will put that on Le Olbrin. The rest of you can apply yeah. it to yourselves. Thank Ol you. Olbrin, you're at 134. I'll put it on Tokai. Okay. 
から I'm having the math over here. Okay.、Uh, let's see. It's technically a trooper. Fucking fights onward. He's like, I never liked you, bitch. He fucking hits the tech witch for 17. I should also、um, go on the c r o d end. Did he do it? Maybe he didn't. Well, thank you. I did not do it. You should do it. There we go. Thank you. Yep. Sorry, I'm still learning the tokens. I don't know where everyone is. Well, you see a huge armored mecha orc running south with a giant chainsaw. Well, her, the look on her face goes from frustration with Nomcath to terror as, as she's so occupied with Nomcath, Tokala gets within about five feet of her, screaming and revving the chainsaw before she turns and realizes she's dead. He <laughs> slams into her blade first, and you hear an agonizing scream that's cut short immediately as he just saws straight through the center of her body and flings her body onto the tech sniper behind her. Then he rolls intimidate. Then he, hell yeah, he does. Because that's what Tokala d o And this guy is going to be shaken. And this guy. Okay. Takala having a good old time down here. Meanwhile. Come back, Luna. Come back. I just want to talk. Luna looks at her over and over. I found that juggernaut. I just want to talk. I、Which just, room is that thing in? I just want to talk. Just I'm not going over there. Pry bar 6K? That's what, that's what the prompt just said. <laughs> I don't know why it said that. I don't know either. It don't make no sense. I know it doesn't, but that's what it said. Whatever, Foundry. Go home. You're drunk. Alright, l、uh, Krokta flies right back to where she just retreated from, lands on the ground, and rubs her antenna together to release the electrical discharge from her voltaic organ. This is getting kind of intimate. I almost had a throbbing voltaic organ, but、oh. I stopped myself. But then you had to say intimate, so now I have to do it. And this is an item you made, by the way. But hold on, I can't get it to like. Oh, so it's, so it's still my fault. Sure. I'm trying to get both of these dudes, but、oh、I can't、God. get the thing to position correctly. Oh, wow. And the template looks funky, but I got what you did. You hit them both. You hit both these dudes, and they have to make a save. Nope. Nope. Two on that one.、Uh, and the room, the, yeah. The Roomba gets a two. The Draugr's get a seven and a four. Oh, that four. Roomba's dead, though, I thought. It's super dead. You're just exploding it, melting、okay. its poor. Ravaged body. Yeah. Excellent. Well played. Dude, these guys in this thorn wall are having the worst time. <laughs> Actually, maybe <laughs> the dudes who failed their whole person save up here are having a worse they're time. They're having a worse time, yeah, yeah. Well, their suffering ended pretty quickly. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like even if I don't do anything for the rest of this combat, the thorn wall has been enough contribution. Yeah. Pretty happy about it. Yep.、Yeah. You're, you're a real piece of work. With your battlefield control bullshit. Alright.、Uh, do you have. You do not.、Uh, there ain't shit you can do. You're just gonna have to wait there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, why not? Okay. Dogger. 
Still in the goddamn thorns, right? This is the end, the tail end of him is right here in front of you, right? Uh, yeah. Because I think I cast it from there originally, so it kind of loops out a little bit. Ten. Mm -hmm. He is stuck in it right there. Hmm. Sure. And Okay. There goes the thorn wall again. He just uh dismiss it. Dispel magic. Yeah. Dispel, yeah, mm. sorry. Sad. <laughs> hey, just wasted a massive dude's turn. Um, yeah. Well, guys, there's a lot of people coming now. So, yeah. yeah. Rubbish, we got an island. <laughs> yeah, hopefully they don't want to attack the little cockroach. Surely they don't know who you are. Yeah, by now, I'm sure they still don't know. Did you just get the big bad guy to spend a turn to spell magicking a wall of thorns? <laughs> yeah, it's the second time he's done it. Absolutely goaded. Can you cast it again? <laughs> no, I'm out. He got lucky enough last time that it recharged. Yeah, we I got the you, items bro. Toby gave me. Yeah, like the first time it ever worked. No, that's yeah, twice. Yeah. Twice, yeah. Twice, yeah. Oh, hell yeah. yeah. Don't you discredit my gorgeous item. <laughs> and Rai noticed it, too. <laughs> yeah, I never notice it. Thank God you guys are paying attention. <laughs> it's like the worst item for me. I'll never look at that. that yeah, no. I, as soon as I made it, I realized it was a mediocre item forever. But I'm glad it's done a couple things. Well, it gives me an extra spell slot, too. So that's cool. Okay. Roomba turns. Roomba go burr. Try it. Roomba do go burr. The sound of running feet as the undead sprint down the hall ahead of their void dragon and Osman. Make a stealth check. Cockroach, you're kind of hard to notice. Okay. Uh, let's see. Is that factoring in the bonus you get from being tiny? It will. I oh, believe wow. it is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it must be. <laughs> he steps in and he does not immediately notice you. He spends his turn. F he eventually sees you by the end of his turn, but he's out of action by then. Sweet. This one, however... Steps over here and swings once at you. <sighs> Take that, you little rat. Oh, it just hit me. Yep, exactly hit you. Okay, what's going on? You've got Luna on your immediate right, Akradin on your left, Ulfred beyond him. Tokala and Namkath, you watch them run north to south, so from your right to the left in the western hallway, so they're close, around the corner to the south of you. Uh, Rai is looking better. Got some heels off, and Akraden's looking better, thanks to the channel I think Ulfra dropped. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. If you wanted oh, the whole dude. party in range for something, you would have to go 20 feet west no i i just didn't know i it, okay. i don't know what the map looks like at all at this point so i'm um, well me neither. have I'm, to I'm, i gotta tell you looking at it, it's not helping me much um so we're, we're moving towards the enemy i guess party yeah seems uh, like they're yeah, coming got, to us we got undead got... things coming from the uh north yeah, Crocta would have been telling you there's a bunch of crazy zombies rushing towards her. Okay, uh, I'll start moving. Then Toby. 
Okay. Where do you want to be? Uh, I'll start moving towards where I guess the rest of the party's going. The rest of the party is pretty much around you. It's only Tokala Except and Tokala that are not here, and Karkta, of course. Okay, yeah, I'll start moving towards them then. Okay. You are right behind Ulfred. Is there anything else you want to do? You have Ulfred on your left and Akraden. Ulfred on your west, Akraden on your east, and then a metal wall north and south. So you're bracketed mm. by big hit bags. Hit bags. How bad are the hit bags around me hurt still? Ulfred's at about 80%, Akraden's at about 70%, Luna's about 90%. You about eighty percent. Uh, do we decide we have macros for cure mod ones or no? I think you do. It, it would be W C well, M, right? I thought. Oh, wand of cure mod. Remember the macro counts of his word, so it's W O C M. Oh, so does it work? Yep. For some reason, it's called. W O C M W. What the fuck? Wand of, cure, wand, wand of cure. Wand of cure. Wand mid. Wand of cure. Wand of cure wounds. Yeah. Wand of cure, cure moderate, moderate wounds. wounds. Oh, oh. Wand of cure moderate wounds. Bam. Okay. I whack and crowd with that bitch. Once again, the macro was doing the job that Josh and I explicitly told it to do, and Josh yes. and I forgot what we told it to do. Explicitly forgot <laughs> to, what we told it to do. Yeah. Okay. Wait, okay. isn't the Crodden under displacement? Mm -mm. Blink. Blink. There's still a mischance. Nah. It's, it's, not, it's not like it's a, a attack roll. He has control of it. Okay. He figured that. He figured out how to do that with his 11 levels of wizard. Uh, Ulbrin, you are done, and it is... <laughs> Yep, I'll heal another nine. Luna knows from Cassandalee's net that there are many bad things coming from north of Ulfred. And there is one more enemy to the south, but Tokala and Namkath are on it. She's going to head north. Okay. I can't move. It's paused. Why? Why would it be paused, Toby? Why? Yeah. That's 25. Yeah. I can't remember how far I can move. Oh, 70, okay. I'm gonna move. Yeah, you have a huge move with haste. I'm gonna move these dead bodies out of the way. No, I'm oh, good. I can get somebody. Explosions pushed them all up against the wall anyway. So move to that bar right there. Okay. And as a single attack. Get him. I can't remember. Can, can I vital strike? Sure, it's, sure. It's a standard action, isn't it? Yeah. Yep. That's what's real good about it. Okay, huge damage. You definitely did, hit. Did I hit. not? Did I? Oh, did hit vital strike. Okay. Okay, good shot. Superior. This guy, five foots back. You know what, you little shit-ass rogue? I'm shooting you. Enjoy this. 27 touch. Misses. Oh. You have a 26. Oh, no, okay, yeah, I'll was, I was think of flat footed. So, yeah, oh, I did, you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> look, look at how cocky the rogue gets later in the campaign. I'm immune to damage. What? I I took damage? Well, I looked at the wrong one. I was like, flat footed. Well, it's okay. I've been there. After you backflip a couple hundred fireballs, you're pretty sure you just don't get hit anymore. Uh, tech Witch. Oh, yeah. She's gonna get that ass. Um. Yeah. Well, this will be unpleasant for you guys. She just hasted all of these barbarian zombies. Oh, goody. And the barbarian rogues are now hasted. Great X, great X, great X, great. 
So there's about half a dozen great axe crits coming down the hall. Okay. And you come running through the crowd. And then it is Nomcat's turn. Alright, so I'm going to make an acrobatics check. Okay. It's Huge. Here. Easily done. And then, because yeah. I know what's going to happen. Yeah. So it's kind of pointless for me to really actually do any real attacks because I can't get my crits. Instead, I am going to go ahead and try and be rogue sneaky. What? So, yes. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? It's not going to get where to go. I don't know why that didn't attack <laughs> when I used it. <laughs> Oh, are you uh, disguising as him? Yes. <clears throat> I will do so blatantly behind his back so that Tokala sees it happening, though. <laughs> mm, you think that's going to matter. I'm interested in why you think I'm not still going to saw you in half, you dirty Technic League fascist. Because he can see me doing the wand and see me changing. <laughs> and then when he comes to attack this guy, I'm going to be uh, 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 a threat so he gets uh, uh -huh. flanking. I hear you trying to make sense, but I think what Tokala would say is, You think I trust these tricky cyber eyes? No way. So, probably going to get you anyway. We'll see. Okay, so now you look like this. Now we can all forget what you look like. <laughs> cool. Anything else? Nope, those are my actions. All right. Barbarian's coming out. It's his whole turn, but he's going to murder Croctal. Hellcaster. Yeah, come on. Let him try. He will try. Your style is unorthodox, but effective. Bam, 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 bam. bam. Five, ten, fifteen. Fifteen. Twenty. Twenty-five. Thirty. Ah, yes. Just for my own edification, uh, the doors in this place, are they like swoosh, side closey doors? Not anymore. They're obliterated. Oh, they're obliterated. Yep. And not just Nobcast's fault. I think one of them got chainsawed. I don't remember. Yeah, I think this. I think this, mm -hmm. this one got. Oops, that one got. That one got chainsawed, uh, so that we get into yeah. here <laughs> where they were attacking us. With they the chainsawed boy. open the door and threw Silex through. That's the. That boy guys. got the right idea. I like that. <laughs> oh, it didn't roll damage. Oh, what'd you cast? I threw a pipe bomb, 2.0, oh. so I can't get over there. <laughs> More oh, explosives in the same are... area. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> so, like, well, I see. I see the template, but I didn't see any, any roll or damage. Yeah, they're, um, some of the older items are bugged. Try it again, Tim. Do you want an earthquake? Because that's how you get an earthquake. <laughs> I want an earthquake. <laughs> this building is always sucked. <laughs> okay, that is... I am gonna lazy GM one save. Everybody fails, eat shit. And again, this Roomba still being pounded into dust. This Roomba is now at minus 135 HP. <laughs> we can save it. <laughs> we can save the Roomba. Uh, I don't know if old Fred can... constitution. It's not actually dead yet. <laughs> I don't think. <laughs> no, no. Ulfred cannot cast mending enough times. I'm sorry. We don't need mending. We just need make hole or greater yeah. make hole. You need a wish. <laughs> need a, several greater make holes, unfortunately. Give us You're... a few levels. We'll do it. Yeah. Whose turn is it? Oh, it was just a Crowdens. Zombie oh, yeah. dude. Zombie dude. Okay. Draugr thing. Yep. 
Still on Wisdom okay. Hellcast. Your Nana me. has several greater holes. Oh! Oh! Waiting for it. <laughs> waiting for it. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Literally, that's been the last couple turns. By the way, yeah, it was a mistake. Hang on, it's not done yet. What? Wait. He just barely entered your reach. I don't think it provoked yet. Okay. Okay. Don't worry. <laughs> chop him to bits. <laughs> I'm going to chop him to bits. Luna's standing there facing down, I don't know, 1200 HP of undead barbarian. She's like, ha, ha, ha. He's almost here. I'm just trying to wait. I'm just trying to wait. I'm just trying to wait. <laughs> All right, so I have a stupid idea. Um, can you bend walls, walls of fire around corners? I don't I know. I think you should be able to. But... Because I did it with the Wall of Thorns, but I had also seen yeah, around that corner. Yeah, you'd up that so you knew where it was. I yeah. think that's why he let you do it. Right. Yeah, but you have Cassandra Lee. She's syncing up all of your knowledge of the Oh, area. yeah. So if Croctaw saw it, you have now seen it. Cool. Oh, man. You're going to stump GPT with that one. Straight wall. Oh. As per raw. Well, can I, like, spellcraft it or something? <laughs> I don't know. Immobile blaze is shimmering. I mean, you can get one, two, three, four of them in it, either right to left or kind of diagonally. Like, you could lay your wall of fire like this and get four. Or you can lay it like this and get those four plus anybody that comes through there. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Um, and you can just be mad at Josh for having ChatGPT rules lawyer you. Sorry. Typical. I really just wanted to use the thing and then that screwed the party. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, let's see. They... Don't they have to save now? Or they have to just take the damage now? I'm pretty sure they just have to take yeah. the damage. Do uh, so like two d six plus fourteen. It says right here in the last paragraph: if you evoke the wall so that it it appears where the creatures are, creatures take damage as if passing through the wall. There you go. The wall deals two d six plus one per caster level. So roll me slash two d six plus one because you're a level one cleric. <laughs> Or that. That's fine, too. You hit the Roomba again. Minus 157. I'm gonna... Oh, Roomba. Roomba. I don't think you rolled that right. 86 plus 14, right? Yeah. Okay, I think so. I think it's... Unfortunately, no. Okay. Yeah, it kind of it... seems kind of low. Damage. <laughs> Okay, I've updated the Roomba's token, so you should now all be able to see its health. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn, Damn, I was I'll... hoping I could firebend it and go down the hallway again. <laughs> that poor Roomba. But raw. Sorry, Alfred. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. The Roomba is dead. There's still a trooper up there. Uh huh. Very important. Did he at least hit this target? Natural three for Tokala's perception. Mm. A total of 27. <laughs> he, he looks at. He looks at the sniper, looks at you, looks at the sniper, he looks at you again, I got looks my back at the, the sniper. I got at least one of the daggers he fully recognizes in my hand. You see him <laughs> rubbing his chin, he, he kind of <laughs> quietly points, points at the gun, then he looks at the sniper and looks at you, kind of points at your daggers, yeah, nods his head slightly. 
I'm pretty sure this isn't you. <laughs> Eeny, meeny, mighty mo it, Jesus. Ah! Uh, he looks... There's two of you, so 60% chance. <laughs> and he murders the fuck out of the sniper. And then he very quickly looks up at you. I give him a double, I give him a double thumbs up. <laughs> yep, that's right. You're right. <laughs> He, he still looks a little unsure, but... Well, it's my voice. It only changes how I look. <laughs> and Toby, I forgot, um, it, the wall does double damage to undead. Ooh! These are true undead. They are Ooh. true undead. That's true. Let me go back and burn them some more. Ugh! Actually, they're looking pretty rough. Well, they've After taken the... bombs and yes. pipe bombs and... Yes. Mm -hmm. They look very battered. All right, five foot step backward. I'm gonna cast a spell. Now he's gonna cast Hurricane within this tiny, <laughs> tiny room, right? <laughs> no, I wish, but I don't have it. But I am gonna do. Let me see. Just trying to figure out where to position it. For some so reason. So, can you clear the the previous template there? Sure. It's making it hard for me to tell. Doosh. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, Is it hard for you guys to place your seventh explosive on this spot? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, so I'll do a flame strike there. Right on top of the Roomba. <laughs> that was a requirement. It had to hit the Roomba, right? Yeah, yeah. Wow. And uh, it says half of it is divine power, so I don't know if that does anything special to the zombies. Yeah, they don't get the, any save against it. Let's see. Um, one save to rule them all. They fail. Okay, so this entire crowd, minus you, you don't fireball yourself, I hope. Oh, yeah, I moved back five. I just haven't done it yet. Okay. Dude, if you would have if, if you would have centered it a little bit lower, you could have got all of them. Well, I was trying to do that, and it was like not hitting the top one. I thought, or the one yeah in the back of the hallway when I moved it down. Nah, it's okay. You can hit them all. I put the damage okay. on all of them. Uh, boom. Why does Croc Croc keep disappearing on? I mean, when I'm clicked on my token. I don't know. She's Trixie. She's a Trixie Hobbit. I think she has the invisibility buff on. Oh, really? Uh, currently off. And she doesn't have the invis trait on. Yeah, I just huh. flicked it on and back on. I think you think seeing the long strider one maybe? Says think is... She has a buff called hidden that's on. Oh, yeah. that's that stupid mod. Don't worry about that. That, that oh, mod, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. we'll that take that out. It's from a mod that I was testing out that we're not really using. It attempts to apply the consequences of perception and stealth checks to tokens so that you guys, like, if, if you fail to perceive someone, you lose sight of them. Mm. That's cool. It's a cool idea, but it's kind of trickier. It's harder to use. It, it costs more time than it saves. So let's see. Move some dead stuff. Out of my way. Why can't I move the dead stuff? Okay. Okay. I'll just delete the token. Okay. I can't do that either. I'm going to have to do a quick little reload. Uh oh. Oh, and it's going to make me relog. Yeah, it deauthenticated me. Foundry hyper secure at all times, you know. Oh, by the way, apparently a door got show closed. Like like your local IT department, we gotta log you out of everything every day for fun. So I don't think that door exists anymore. It got destroyed. You guys have really trashed, structurally trashed this area. That's for sure. I hope you're proud of yourselves. It's not my fault. You were there. You're an accomplice. <laughs> I mean, if I if I really want to, I can pull out my rocket, my grenade launcher. You're an accessory to Starfall terrorism. I, can, mm -hmm. I could throw out my anti-tank missile launcher. Well, 
This is an enclosed area, but I don't see why not. Go ahead and do that on your next turn. I think you should do it. Okay, I am back. I can move. And this Hellcaster steps around the corner. Into the fire? Into the fire. Roll me some new damage. And I'll just do the double damage on here. Sure. Oh, takes a bunch of damage. And then cast Dominate Person on Luna. Uh-oh. Let's see that one. That one. Except for it doesn't work. Let's see that one. <laughs> Come on, natural one. Natural one, and I win the whole campaign. New characters. Oh, boy. Natural one. Come on, Rye. Come on, Rye. Give me that natural, natural one. one. Come on, Rye. Mmm, you do fail unless you've got some secret bullshit. I think I have. I don't know if I have any secret bullshit oh, here. Oh, right. Can you cast Dominate Person? Gonna get a new campaign. Wait, yeah, that's Dominate Person. Doesn't work on me. Why not? Wait. You're a person. You're no, -uh. never mind. It does work. Yes, it does work on me. Yeah, pretty sure you're a person. Pretty sure you're dominated. The only thing I see is your notes there that says you you got plus two versus spells that you can cast. So can you cast dominate person? It still wouldn't be enough. <laughs> Needs to get right. to nineteen. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> you guys remember when I mind controlled McGinnis like three times in the choking chair? Damn it! God, no, we don't remember that. that. Five God, times. that was. <laughs> Party took emotional damage from that shit. And, and lethal damage, too. <laughs> oh, McGinnis is deadly, man. He just turns and lit somebody up every time. It's beautiful. Did he kill someone? Just about. Oh. I don't think he ever fully killed anybody. No, he got close, he though. serious damage. No, that, is yeah. that, I, that is not a spell that I can cast, sadly. Right. Either way, you are three short of not... Okay. He dominates you, and on your next turn, you will spend your full effort murdering your party. So, yeah. Oh, fuck. I forgot he was still toying with this guy. God, this is going to be cruel. Okay. All right, buddy. You called down the thunder. Somewhere a Technic League trooper is cut in half for 70. Non-crit. Hmm. Nope. Nope. There we go. Okay. Yeah. The party has moved northwest into the control room that Nomcath devastated with multiple Silex explosions. Mm -hmm. You are in the south hall alone, and you hear something ten feet to the east behind you, and you turn and see a Roomba. <laughs> Kill it! <laughs> Ominous. Hey, as long as it's not stabby, we're good. Okay. 
Is there no save for Wall of Fire? I don't think there is. Where was that damage at? He takes it. He comes sprinting through and then... Ooh. AOO, Luna. I uh, guess, yeah, I do get an AOO. You do. He did not beat your CMD at all. You have a huge but she, even though she's dominated? But she's dominated. Ulfred, you don't have reach. I don't have reach. You. Okay. He tumbles through here. Uh, he's going to come actually this way, past this guy. So he sees like a giant blood rager, a, a badass dwarf, and he's like, no, I'm going to go kill the little cockroach. Yeah, because he's smart. Motherfucker. He's like, I will get <laughs> obliterated in one round if I go over there. He will just kind of stab you and miss. Because you have a monster armor class. Okay, now this guy, five foot. No, Luna's dominated. He charges Ulfred. Charge. Charge it. He just, wa that he just walked through fire, too. <clears throat> he did. He charges, and you deflect it with your shield, and then Wall of Fire burns him to death. He had been uh, silexed and hit with rocks, and yeah, it had been a long day for him. Okay, what's going on? I move to see the things, so I can see the things. You move past Akradin into the control room. So Akradin is now 10 feet south of you and your former position is 20 feet south of you. You enter the control room. You see a ton of computer screens, keyboards, metal desks, chairs, all shattered, pulverized into smithereens, pushed to the far corners of the room by the initial explosion that shattered everything and then the subsequent explosions which knocked it all around and just practically atomized it. Incidentally, you can still kind of make out that there were like 20 computers and a open, uncovered toilet in the corner of this room with a little prison sink next to it. Huh. And cool. to your immediate west, 10 foot northwest is Luna. 10 foot uh, north northwest is Ulfred. Somewhere in the room is Crocta, 25, 30 feet northwest of you, buzzing around. And there are one, two, three, four, five undead barbarians. Some are casters, some are actual barbarians with great axes. They are all 20 to 35 feet west of you, coming out of that passage. And Ulfred's got a wall of fire that's burning him. Um... I I did not see did I see Luna get dominated? No. You come in the room and you did not see that happen. But Cassandra Lee did, Ulfred did, Crocta did, and actually Luna's in Cassandra Lee's network. So Cass tells you guys instantly that Luna has been dominated by the enemy and it's not her fault. She really tried. Don't be mad at her, you guys. It's not her fault, she really tried. Okay. Mm -hmm. So and I will do this. Uh, oh, what the hell did that happen? Displacement? Displacement? I think you meant to dispel no. magic. I did, yeah. Give me that back. Give me that back, Gil. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Uh, so what would this spell then be? <laughs> Three D M. Oh, dispel magic, yeah. Duh. Uh. <laughs> you know, this would be better. It's a great if, system. And, it's a perfect if, system. It's a perfect system. We did a great well, job designing it. I'm really proud of it. I think that did and they picked. Work. I think I did great work. And that and yeah. We could always rename spells if it ever made more sense to you, but I think we'd be setting ourselves up for more failure. Okay. The spells. Oh yeah. Yeah. It rolled the caster level inherently. And you get a caster level of 22 or lower. What the fuck did it roll? Oh, it rolled a 19 on the dispel check. You pull down the dominate. You're no longer dominated, Luna. Fuck yeah. Because it was about to be your turn. You were about to fucking serve it up hot to your party's healer. 
Don't need that bullshit. <laughs> Good job, wizard. I'm going to try it again, though. Damn it. I was one turn away from doing hundreds <laughs> of points of damage to the party with the party. That was going to be delicious. I mean, Ulfred has a 40 AC, so. And he's tough. She probably wouldn't have killed him. Okay, that's my turn. Hell yeah. I'll heal a little bit. Cassandra Lee tells everyone Luna is no longer dominated. It, she she tried and she's now free of the spell. So don't, you know. The emergency situation has now ended. <laughs> oh man, that was going to be a good one. I'm kind of bummed. This could Not, be. I, wa I want you guys to win and all, but that was going to be just legendary. <laughs> She was going to crit like three times in a row, and Alfred's going to be like, what the fuck, man? I would have flipped my table <laughs> like, after this long. <laughs> uh, yeah. Ah, oh, fuck it. I'll, I'll just, uh... She's going to pull attack Alfred anyway. <laughs> no. Nope. Hell no, yeah. that guy. You're gonna do what now? Oh, full attack this guy, or if I, if I if he drops five foot him, hop and get him, sure. Or you got reach. I got reach. Yeah, let yeah. it happen. Get him. Get his ass. All right, that's gonna hit. Hit. He's down. And the last of them. Well, I don't. Five foot hop and do the uh, other ones. Yeah. So one, two, and then this guy. Twenty-eight will hit. Yes, I know. And then 42 will hit. You dropped two of them. Good job. That is the end of her turn. Sometimes I wonder which one will be your last lie. Okay. Uh, I forgot. I got to use a round of rage. You underestimate my power. <laughs> Ulfred, your wall of fire goes down. Fair enough. It did its job. Sometimes I plop these sound effects and just forget about them for months. And then it's like a treat. <laughs> so calls right. it, Who's this tech sniper? It's me. It's Nomcat. I'm oh, oh, I knew it was you. All right. So I put my daggers away and I'm pulling out my sniper rifle. I get a good, uh, I can't even really get a view here. I can get somewhat of a view. Post up over here for right now. You're hasted, so you got more movement if you want it. Yeah, but... Me standing in the middle of all this when he comes in would kind of ruin my idea. Not to mention, sure. well, I could do draw hand signs to convince the rest of my rest of the rest of my party would know exactly uh, what's going on because Cassandra Lee our uh, technically uh, current ally doesn't know so let's not <laughs> provoke attack of opportunity <laughs> I can just barely I'm gonna see stab him. you whether I knows or not <laughs> Uh, what the heck? I'll see if I can hit the scout. Okay. You have a narrow line of sight, but that's what this gun's made for. Very narrow. Yeah, you hit him. You shot him straight through the pancreas. You can't believe how accurate the shot was, and then you're like, undead. He, he doesn't care. Okay. It doesn't actually amount to that much damage, but you're like, eh. Put the shot right where I meant to, basically. Yep. Okay. Dragger. Kill little bug. Oh, he's hasted too. Lots. Oh. Oh shit. Oh, I didn't confirm. see it yet. Scrolling down the chat. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I see. Uh, did not confirm. Damn. Wait. You guys and your monster ACs saves you from so oh, many yeah. crits. Nice. 
Just okay, so barely. Just... Nearly chopped your little roach in half. Almost. Almost. Mm, yeah. Wow, oh, no. down by three. Another Hellcaster steps into the room. Uh, uh. Who's that on? Mm, they're smart enough to identify. Yeah. they. You look like a barbarian, so they're going to hit you with it. You have a good will save, but they don't know that. So Luna... Well, Luna. That, it's not that great. Yeah, but it's they they're the risen hellcasters are very smart for undead and they clearly see that Ulfred's a cleric and they see a flying animal figure it's a druid. So they're they're banking on you having the worst will save. Oh okay. probably right. Kill the party. Kill oh my God. <laughs> You guys hear uh, Cassandra Lee on cast net go, hell yeah, fuck you. <laughs> get out, get out of my bubble, get out of my. Blah, blah, blah. She's oh, she's pissed off. Off. That's twice that she's had to make a save. Now she's coming after those old fuckers. Yeah, your style is unorthodox but effective. Bam, bam. I thought that we use. I thought these barbarians were way less dangerous than they are, but I'm gonna stab them anyway. These these barbarians? I mean, they've got a great axe. I'm terrified of great axes for good reason. Mm -hmm. A carrion crown has suffered like three deaths from great axes. Two or three. Yeah, I'll charge this guy. Hell yeah. Actually, I'll just use my base move without charging, because mm -hmm. I don't want my AC to be lower. There's a barbarian right there. And he just gets a regular single attack. I'm not going to use no bullshit. If I challenge him and he dies, I get the challenge back, right? Yeah. Good thing we're going to do that. Oh. Ding. Uh, boom. Crodden steps over and takes the head off the shoulders of this caster. Or this scout. He's gone. I am. I hope, I hope, I hope. Since we still have some guys that are down hit points and we're together at the moment, I'm going to channel again. Okay. Okay. Thank you. And I'll stay here. Okay. Did you play that to me, Toby? Uh, let me apply it. Thank you. Yes, yes, yes. 31. Is on you. You're basically full. You're at 165. Thank you. Takala runs up to the other fight. Damn. <laughs> Poor little guy. Okay. I talk to the uh. I can't remember. Undead can't get affected by, like, mind-affecting stuff, right? Nah. Not usually. Right. Unless it's a vampire or some really higher undead. Hmm. Hmm. What should I do? Well, I'll five foot for sure. Okay. And... I don't know if I want to cast this, but I am curious, like... They have verbal components in their spells, but they're skeletons. So, like, do they breathe or, like, use air to cast spells? No, they don't breathe, and they appear to be some variant of shit-ass sorcerer, like Olbrin, so 
they probably have still and silent spells available to them. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, yeah, I think I'll just five foot and do another stone discus. Um, I'll do it at the guy that was attacking me. Get him. He made you bleed your own blood. Mm. That will hit, hit, and even a natural two hits. Cool. Okay. Uh, oh, man. You know what? It's been a while. Why don't we all make confusion saves again? No. It's been a while. No. It's been a while. DC is right after my turn. It's been a while. It's right after Croctaw's turn. It's a great time to do it. It's a DC 18? Yeah. I made it. Everyone made it. Oh, I can't fail it. Well, you could. I guess. You could roll that one. Like Rye was supposed to do. Let's see. Okay, let's see. Uh... Okay. Nomcath, perception check. Crappy. Damn, you did. Oh, if it's hearing based, I get to plus five. Thirty-five. You, it would be hearing based. Let me check this. Yeah. It doesn't have that. Shouldn't have that. In it. Let me just make sure it wasn't in, adding in shit it shouldn't add in. 35, do you have any other perception bonuses? No, that's pretty much it. So you get to 35. Yep. Okay. A door opens behind you, and a void dragon's head silently pokes out. <laughs> oh, man. And she disintegrates you. And she does not confirm the crit. Um, come on, Foundry. Okay, it will not let me reveal it to you guys. Yep. Obnoxious. All right, I rolled a natural 20 on the attack, and I hit armor class, touch armor class 37. And the damage is 91. I'm still alive. <laughs> you can make a fort save versus DC 30. Yeah, you nope. take the full 91. All right. I'm still alive, though. Well played. Uh, let's see. Let me fix so this. was one of the two frontliners that would that that would be okay. I'm back. Yeah. Did I get disintegrated? No, nope, I almost did. No, Dumbcat did. Jesus Christ! I am down to 25 hit points. And with your incredible perception, next to. The void dragon that just peeked its head out of the conference room and disintegrated you. <laughs> oh my god. The Roomba comes out. Dunk. It <laughs> runs into your foot a couple times. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Okala goes into a rage. <laughs> it heads south. Let's hear that again. 
beautiful. Castnet is telling you that the Void Dragon has somehow gotten from the North Hall into the conference room and just surprise disintegrated Namkath. He has survived, barely. Okay. That's happening to the south of you where you just were. Good thing you didn't stay standing there. Oh. Uh, so I can't see the Void Dragon now? Nope. It is around a corner, which is 25 feet south of you. If you ran to where Namkath is, you could probably see her. Um, we still don't know where Osman is. He's somewhere. We don't. I don't know. Cass says, I don't know where he is. I could scan for him, but Unity might know that I exist if I did that. Uh, I say you, you just nuke the frickin juggernaut and kill us all right now all right um wow that's dark yeah yeah uh so what's going on where i'm at um well somewhere down the hall you hear the beautiful yeah yeah in your room however it is mass violent death The party just laughed off a confusion spell as if it wasn't the 30th time that's been used against them. And the undead are piling up in this room, but there are two undead casters and an undead tech, or a, not undead, tech witch on the far western side of the wall. That is 30, 45 feet west of you. There's one undead barbarian loose running around, but mainly it's the three casters, two of which have already demonstrated they can cast Dominate Person, and then the tech witches are just level 14 wizards. They're horrible. Okay, are any of them hurt? The tech witch is pretty fresh for the fight. One of the casters has been hit, the southern one, and the northern one is untouched. Uh, okay, they so are standing how many... next to a Roomba, which has taken... 226 below zero HP. <laughs> so I can get... How many people can I get in like a chain lightning or lightning bolt? You can get those? all three casters. Plus, you can also hit... You could get the Rika the... again. You could also get the, the Barbarian. Yeah, he should be close enough. 30 feet. Tech Witch, fails. Hellcaster, fail. Hellcaster, fail. Barbarian, even if he makes it, he's blown to Mars. The three spellcasters fail and each take 79, one of which the uh, Risen Hellcaster is killed. The Tech Witch looks incredibly wounded. That was a mega, <laughs> mega lightning bolt. Well, this is the first time you guys are probably going to see her do this. Got a five foot step. She's got to take a deep breath. And she's pretty much hitting, hitting these. Cone of Dragon's Breath. Okay. Oh, nice. Uh, it? So it's a 30 foot cone of fire. What color is it? Are you fire? Okay. Yeah, it's fire. It's gold. So 30 foot cone of fire. Roll me uh, 12d6. Slash D space 12d6. I think they might be dead even if they make this. Um, uh, you said uh, slash D space 12 D6. You do max for this. Luna got like dragon blood or something? Yeah, Blood Rager. She's a. Uh, whoa. What did you roll? You just <laughs> rolled 126. 26. You got to put a D in there, <laughs> Rye. You cheating <laughs> bastard. <laughs> Well, How do I do it again? Slash D space one two D six. Got to put a D in there. You got to put the D always. in there. Always got to give the D. Yeah, always put the D in there. Still pretty good. That's still respectable. Always put the D in. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh. Always put the dragon in. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Okay, the let's see. Yep, looks good. You rolled really good damage dice. Let's see if these two make amazing saves. Yeah. No. Okay, this guy is definitely taking full damage. Roomba definitely taking full damage. Tech Witch definitely taking half damage, barely surviving Roomba at negative 278. How low can you go? That poor Roomba. Yeah. Sometimes I wonder which one will be your last lie. Well. Whoa. Tech Witch disappears. All right. Well, so does Nomcat, because I... He's not staying there for that. <laughs> she just got the fuck out of Dodge, didn't she? <laughs> yeah. You can roll Spellcraft. Uh, Ulfred, Luna, Croctaw, Ulbrin could all roll Spellcraft. If any one of you makes it, you know she cast. Oh, yeah. Ulbrin, 36, she cast Teleport Greater. And by the look on her face, she went really far away. Far, far, <laughs> far, 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 far. Oh, I far, guess I can't. I guess I technically can't make that because I'm, I'm, I'm raging. Oh, eh, you're a blood rager. I would still let you try. Um, yeah, she definitely was a very high level wizard in combat with four HP. She cast teleport greater. Now I'm Kath doing little techie nerd things. Your style is unorthodox, but effective. Um, we seem to have no targets. There's a really big one back there if you're really wanting something to do. Uh, I don't want something to do that bad. And the, by the way, this is for <laughs> the tech sniper that's saying that to you. <laughs> it sounds like Nomcath. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw you get disintegrated. You're not a tech sniper. I was down around the corner. You didn't see shit. <laughs> ah, you know, I imagine there's a disintegration-esque smoldering coming off of you right now. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> no, you smell like ozone for sure. I guess I'm going to delay. I don't want to monkey pound into what's waiting down either of these hallways. <laughs> Somebody's got a monkey pound, goddammit. All right, fuck it. I'll go look north. What could possibly be up here? Wasn't Arcadian just up there? Yeah, but that was a while ago. Maybe my guy killed everything up there. Yeah, he was good. <laughs> mm. You turn the corner and you see him just like split in half mm. on the floor. He is actually alive and stabilized. What a fucking legend. 35, 40, 45, 50. Eh, yeah, seems pretty chill up here to me. Oh, they're probably both down there. Oh, yeah, they're probably back over here, yeah. They're probably both down there. I thought they might pinch us. They didn't. Alright, that's it. I will move here in front of everyone, and then I will channel again because reason. Toby, what, what role would I make to know what the hell a Void Dragon is? Uh, knowledge Arcana. We, we've run into one. Yeah, didn't we? In uh, the... Those, uh, what's it called? The Void of the... On those aliens, they had one, right? Yeah. We made, like, oh, you them. ran into one that had been lobotomized and had an intellect devourer living in it. Mm. Did we? I don't remember that. Yeah. Yeah, the yeah he tried to disintegrate someone then, too, right? That is a very powerful polymorphed wizard in dragon form. That we encountered before? No, this one. Oh, oh. And it's been a while since, so I'll give it to you guys. But you heard that Grin, Grin was 
massively cybernetically enhanced by Osman and other tech tech league tech that nobody knew the source of exactly and she is a shape she can shape shift into a certain types of dragons hmm. so you're pretty I'm sure, pretty sure. technically captain grin Rassico. okay so two buff to the max 17 lines of buffs on wizards that's what we're gonna fucking fight now uh -huh. hey if I crit I can dispel shit true and if I uh, any of my sneak attacks dispel Anything else, Ulfred? Did you apply the healing to Tokala? Let me put that on. Tokala. Boom. It's on him. That's it. He going after that poor Roomba. He would like to. You know he would. He's crazy like that. Christa, uh, it would set him up for a pincer attack for anything that come down that hall. Pincer. Let's see. Deadly juggernaut. Already got that. Okay. Uh, Updates are calling spells real quick. That's already been cast. That he has not done. That has been done. So he's still. He's gonna just go ahead and put freedom of movement on himself. Did Arcaden say that no one was down that hallway he went down? No one that I see! Hmm. Okay. I think they're both down there, unless Osman's hiding in this bunk bed here. <laughs> He's all tucked in. He is. He took a nap. Okay. It's been well, a long then day. I won't go that way, then. So, do I know from uh, Cassandra Lee where this boy dragon is? Yeah. Oh, yeah, south. <laughs> okay, south hall. Stop me. All right. Mm -hmm. right here. I think I can get like fifty movement, so I think I could get down there. Okay. Don't you have haste? Uh, have more than fifty. Oh yeah, yeah, true. So okay, so I see the void dragon. Mm -hmm. Um. And we said it's actually a wizard, right? So. Well, she, like you, is fully polymorphed into the form she's in, so you treat her as a dragon. Hmm. Okay. Unless we can dispel that spell. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's probably smarter than what I was going to do. So let me do that. <laughs> what were you going to do? I was going to become Chad on the Void Dragon. But. <laughs> My God! Oh, God do it! Do it! Do oh, it! Oh my God! No! <laughs> I mean, it would lose a wizardiness, but then it would just be like a vicious dragon. Still, what is yeah, that uh, spell actually? Become uh, primal regression. Oh, oh we we're fucking calling it become Chad. <laughs> yes, because the one oh. time he's used it, he used it on the wizard. Okay. Crimson <laughs> Luna. He did get yeah. the shit out of Luna. All right, fuck okay, it. I'll try it. All right, I actually cast Become Chad on the Void Dragon. <laughs> That's the sound of that spell being cast, by the way. Um, okay. The dragon attempts to resist Become Chad. Uh, she makes it barely. by two. Damn. Barely made it. All right, and now I'm stuck here. Uh, I'm the only thing the dragon can see, so that's great. 
I like it. I like your tactics. <laughs>
Yeah. Oh, I just applied it again. <laughs> okay, how come oh, I did you? Yeah, we both clicked it. It's okay though. It doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you had 196, and you. That was my maximum. Were yeah. you at full? No, I wasn't. I don't think I got Ulfred's channel earlier. Okay. Oh, you got his channel earlier. Yeah, you did. No, did he do it before he moved? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, hey, he purposely did it before we split up. I got news yeah, for I'm, you, I'm bud. still dead. I got news for you, bud. If you received Ulfred's last channel, I never hit you that hard because I didn't confirm the crit, right? Yeah, he didn't, he didn't confirm the credit at all. He got what healed through that. What were you at? You would have been at full uh, health. I don't know. I tend to think Rai is correct about that. And if Rai is correct about that, you motherfucker have a 20 con. You're not dead. You just took 213 thanks to your electrical resistance. Your electrical resistance did save you. All right. You were at negative 17, and you're not dead dead you are down way down but because of her incredible constitution she is not dead dead amazing now the void My dragon turn. disintegrates you <laughs> <laughs> no i'm kidding Go for it. i don't honestly it'd be pretty <laughs> what <funny>. do i care <laughs> <laughs> fuck you dragon piece of okay she turns the corner the Void Dragon accidentally steps on me, not even knowing I'm there, and I'm just crushes me to death. She steps the cor turns around the corner, this just absolute shape of pure night blackness. It's dark against the blackened walls from where the explosions have happened. And there's just occasional glimmers of this weird blue and purplish glow where her multitude of dozens of eyes down the sides of the head, long black horns, and as she turns, you see this maw open up, and inside the maw is sort of a brighter blue light that pours out, but you realize it is just bioluminescent gas. And she fills this entire area, catching Ulfred, Tokala, Namkath, slash this tech sniper, and Olbrin in her suffocation breath, which is a DC 25 fort save. Namkath oh. has failed by one. Olbrin made it by huge. You rolled a 34. Ulfred with the nat 20. Tokala. 34. I can't believe you missed by one, Namkath. Yeah, uh, I'm down on this. I... <laughs> Uh, if I'm you... Sure I'm sure she's going to do more than... You seven. immediately begin to suffocate. On your next turn, whenever that may be, you fall unconscious and you reduce to zero HP. The next round, you go to negative one and begin dying. Okay. The third round, you die. Room On mark. a happy note. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> It sucks me it's, up into it's the room. Yeah, it's gonna be fucked up. <laughs> oh, it turns. It turns. You see a little beam of light come out as it scans it the little pile of shit on the ground. There's a dead bug on the ground. <laughs> you know what I was gonna do this next my next turn? Please suck up Crocta. Honestly, it's it's worth it. <laughs> <laughs> Crocta sucks up to No, you did Roomba! <laughs> and <laughs> the Roomba, you hear it go, <laughs> as the cockroach body parts get stuck in its fan, and you hear it go, <laughs> sort of struggle for a sec. And then you hear it go like this. Full of strength save. And it starts heading, it drives directly under the Void Dragon, Damn back it. to the east. That back would have been to, double things. Uh, it's going to go back to its base and dump her. The, the thing is, I was, <laughs> going to, I was going to go for the save again. I was going to go for the mage hand. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been awesome. Turn the body honestly... over and dump a, uh, at least dump a, uh, a Cure Light Wounds potion <laughs> onto the bug. <laughs> that would have been good. 
but I really love the Roomba actually like, doing something evil after all of this time. After all this time. <laughs> it's vengeance. Tokala was, was right, you guys. Tokala was right. Tokala was right, yep. Damn. This is the Roomba does his job. This is the stupidest shit I've ever done. Okay. <laughs> Somebody throw me at the Void Dragon! Uh, okay. Oh, what do I see, Tobas? Well, to the west of you is Rai and a bunch of dead, undead spellcasters. To the south of you is the two most powerful beings you've ever seen in combat. Directly south of you is Tokala, Ulfred, and then the Void Dragon 20 feet south of you. And Osman himself is 50 feet down the hall to the south of you. And a suffocating Nomcath. Right a suffocating Nomcath. Nom yeah, Nomcath immediate, like, this gas hit all of you. And it's starting to dissipate. It's it's a weir the weirdest smell. Breathing it at all makes it feel like all the air in your lungs is just deleted. So Namkath unfortunately got a face full of it, and you see him fall back against the wall, disguised as a tech sniper still, still in danger of being chainsawed by Tokala, and start, like, clutching his neck and struggling to stand. Um... Is there something I can do to save you, Namkath? You could dispel it. Okay, is it a dispellable thing? It's a ma yeah, it's still a spell effect. Okay, should I do that or should I? Th eh, none of the beaters around me to throw them, are they? Uh. Luna is Tokala's fifteen feet away. Tokala is five feet, ten feet away. Yeah, you, yeah, you could five foot step and touch Tokala. <clears throat> yeah, if you five foot step south, you can touch Namkath and Tokala. You could th uh, throw the suffocating Nomcath onto the Void Dragon. <laughs> you could throw Luna at the, vo at the Void Dragon, too? She's out of reach. Well, yep. you would be a difficult throw from there. Luna's kind of around the corner from a dragon. She can see it, though. Okay, what's the range? <clears throat> what's the range on Telekinetic Charge? Uh, 50? The last time we looked it up, it was stretching out to maybe 60. Uh, telekinetic charge. Yeah, because in theory, you could, you could telekinetic charge past the dragon to Osman. <laughs> 25 plus half caster level. So, yeah, 60. All right, which do you think Tokala would rather be thrown at? dragon the dragon I mean, you could also technically throw luna at the dragon too you're too far away i can't reach you if no you walk, you can, walk. no you can you can reach you can reach me because you can it's a it's a 30 25 plus five foot range if you go to luna you do not have a clean throw towards the dragon but more importantly i I, th I thought you were going to try to save Nomcath and Telekinetic Charge. Um. Uh, okay, how does Big Dick Quick Stick work? Does that... It, you activate it, it's just like a... It turns whatever spell you're trying to cast into a swift spell. Okay. All right, I do that, and I throw. You'll have to spin. Uh, let's see. Let's do this. Oh, it's you not... need more. Do you need more third level spells? Well, you have two third levels left. You could dispel. It's a four, it's a fourth level spell. Oh, um, it's okay, charge. Yeah. So you want to spend? What do you want? A fifth or a seventh level? You want a fifth level slot? Yeah. Why is this not working? What? You're out of I'm fourth level to... spells. I know. I'm trying to spend a fifth level. S Which to... spell? It doesn't matter. I'm just spending a fifth level, so it because I'll have to cast 
telekinetic charge as a fifth level spell in order to use it because i'm out of fourth okay i've moved a spell slot from fifth to fourth you can now do charge so four Just click it. I can't fucking yes, do it. I don't know what's going on. Okay. No! Oh, they expect one of us in the wreckage, brother. Okay, so that's the throw to Gala. Yeah. At the... You can throw him on this side of the dragon, right in front of Ulfred. He would block Ulfred. You can throw him on the far side of the dragon, but that would put him right next to Osman. Um, and you can... Wherever tactically makes sense. I don't. I don't know. Okay. Uh, yeah, just do Alfred, the geometry about, for me. Ulfred, think about where you'd like Tokala plopped. And do you want to attempt to dispel magic on Numb Camp? Yeah. Okay. I think it would make sense to put him behind him. Well, here's the other thing: or, is or over here. Given the size of the yeah, well, given the size of the dragon, if Tokala goes here, you can go here and still attack the dragon. Yeah. Then Luna can come up behind. And reach reach. Yep. I don't think we want to get flanked by those two right now. No. No. Good point. Hmm. And say I'll I'll post up with my sniper rifle and and hit. <laughs> the spell didn't work, Tubby. The spell worked. You just rolled so shitty. So shitty. Before. Yeah. Um, so you can only dispel a caster level of 7 or lower. And he's hit with a 14th level caster level spell. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. Um... So Tokala is thrown. Did you melee decide where you want Tokala? And he gets yeah. to attack on his round, on my round? Mm -hmm. Yep, he gets attacked immediately. He does so. He activates Dragon Bane and Secret Weapon. And he rolls a two and misses. Damn. Oh boy. Awesome. Yeah. 69. Wizard not helping at all this round. Oh boy. S setting our melee up to very fucking bad rolls. Terminated. I don't know how I'm gonna do this if I can't if I can't get close enough. You got reach, right? Yeah, but Ulfred's right. Just delay. Uh, I guess I'll delay till after all. I'll, this I'll is delay. a square you can stand in. She's right here. You can reach the enemy without blocking Alfred. Yeah, fair enough. Well, she'll go ahead and, you know... Okay. You have a 39 to hit. You actually hit the dragon. That is her AC. She is some bullshit. Let's see. Don't see any particular cold resistance. Okay. Yeah, you hit her. Okay. You guys feel the communication effect of Castnet drop? And Nomcath, you... Let's see. Well, we'll see. If this even works. Yeah, do this. Okay. Why did it do that? Oh! It didn't add in the caster level correctly. Why didn't you add that correctly, you goober? Oh, because it's uh, Olbrin's. All right. 
Okay, so that's... Your suffocation is cancelled. Alright. Hey! And now only Nomcath can hear and communicate with Cassandali. She's like, I'm sorry, you were gonna die. It's okay, it's okay. He knows. He's gonna find out one way or another. Fuck it, since he's a... I don't know. Fuck it. We'll worry about it later. And it is now... Uh, your turn. I'm gonna okay. put her initiative right before yours. So I can't see anything from this corner, so I am going to move here and post up with my sniper rifle and take this round to uh, start aiming for those crits so maybe I can start picking off spells. So your style is unorthodox. But effective. Um, well, I can either truck all the way down the hall for two rounds, or I was thinking I could teleport into this side room, and then I would be able to flank the dragon next round. Either way, I can't do anything this round, but I've only got one teleport. I mean, he what do you... would probably want to save that for escape, but if he's really yeah. feeling like betting the house he knows this compound very well he could easily teleport around the corner behind osman or around the corner behind the dragon he knows like i said he knows the layout very well what do you have in terms of ranged attacks not jack a whole shit. lot jack fucking shit I could throw a pipe bomb it yeah would... that's that's about it because there would be no place for you to uh to melee, melee the dragon even if you did spend two rounds getting here yeah, so it's either teleport behind it and then hit it next round, like if I teleport in this room, or fling pipe bombs at it. I would suggest that he... Uh, I mean, the way I the way I view him is, at this point, he's all in on beating these two. He's either going to die to them or kill them. And he could big dick quick stick dimensional blade, which he knows he will need against them because they both have amazing AC. Mm -hmm. Makes him hit on touch for the rest of the fight. And he could then also just normal cast teleport. And he knows he could get into a position where they wouldn't know he was there until he came around the corner and hit him. Yeah, I like that. Uh, I will teleport. Do you want to be to... behind the dragon or husband? Let's be behind the dragon. We'll whittle him down. Tactically, that is wiser. Okay. Yeah, if he can get dragons on touch. He can. Bam, 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 bam. When he casts Dimensional Blade, he basically has a lightsaber, too. That last Dimensional Blade only lasts for one round. What? Does it? Yeah. It's a swift action, but only lasts for one round. Oh, then there's no reason to put... Yeah, don't quick stick. Don't it's basically it just glorified True Strike. Yep. Yeah, if he was going to, like, full attack, like, multi-swing, I guess he would do that. Oh, that doesn't make sense. He might do, um, Sonic Form, just to prevent them from critting him. Wouldn't prevent Osmond from hitting him with the Null Blade or her with her Void Claws, but it would prevent them from critting him. Sonic Form is pretty bullshit. Okay, so he beams over. You can decide if you want to quick stick one of those buffs or not, because I know you're still having to read five paragraphs of spells. No, uh, I uh, I would love to quick stick Sonic form, but I think he's got a lesser quick stick, lesser meta magic meta magic rod, so it only goes up to third oh, level it's spells. Limited to three. Yeah. Yeah, he's kind of a broke bitch. Couldn't lie to you. <laughs> uh... So yeah, it's like maybe a, a scorching ray. <laughs> <laughs> Bang! Take that, losers! Yeah, not much to put up then. Uh, infernal healing. Might as well have it on. Might as well have it, yeah. Okay, Alright, I'll dropped. do that. Croctop wishes she had infernal healing on right now. Um, and just spend your quick stick. Actually, I'm not going to do the infernal healing. He's only got two quick stick charges left. Yeah, but what else you can do with him? 
I'm gonna swing twice if I survive the first round. Ooh. <laughs> Full attack. Holy shit! Mm. Natural one misses. Three misses. 46 hits. 43 confirms the crit for 88. The void blade, she is very resistant to void damage, but it is 88. Okay. You hit her really, really hard. Then I yell, feck off! <laughs> God damn, what a hit. Also, sorry for running up the wrong hallway earlier. All good. I'm just trying to help. <laughs> God, Give him the juice. I want to see Tokala intimidate the dragon. He might. He's intimidating. He's very intimidating. Okay, that. Oh, yeah. Tokala's immune to confusion because of the armor. Oh, God. And he's already used that power. He's already self-greased himself, let's be real. <laughs> Dude runs around with the greased up buff full time. Um, uh, let's see. Do we, do we know enough about Osman to know if he's likely to run away? If this dragon dies and it looks like he's going to get killed? Uh, we don't know much about him. Fucker. And in the past, Cass has said, and Akraden would know, that Os Osmond is not himself. Old Osman, like six months ago Osman, yeah, he, he would have pushed out and tried to run away. This Osmond, who knows? Mm. He's, he's ascended to a terrifying level of power, and he just doesn't seem like the same person anymore. Uh, okay, Tokala is going to chainsaw a dragon, which is always a dream of yours, I know, Tracy. Um... How to chainsaw your dragon. That's right. <laughs> uh, he's going to give a single big vital strike with Bane and see the opponent. He's going to hit the hell out of her for Holy 70 shit. with the adamantine chainsaw goes through the DR. She looks really upset about that. Very hurt. Thing is still over there. Yeah, where the fuck is it? <laughs> In the other room! Luna saw it. Never saw yeah, it. Yeah, Luna saw it. And was like, <laughs> Luna knows where it is. She's like, I'm, I'm too hurt for this shit. So I think uh, <laughs> I have to roll a 20 to stabilize, right? <laughs> you gotta roll amazing. You gotta do a con check that's just crazy good. No, that's not oh. it! That's oh, not it! Right. <laughs> Way <laughs> down. Yeah, You're stabilized DC 27 out. You can no longer make it without a natural 20. Yeah, yeah. Uh, obviously, natural Ooh. one's not great. So you're now at minus 18. Two rounds from permadeath. But why does it just keep adding 18 into it instead of letting yeah. you put in negative 18? Meanwhile. <laughs> Is the Roomba going to path in here? Well, you don't know it. that Croctaw's in there. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah I was gonna I'd say, be like, you gross, he's a notice. fucking cockroach. <laughs> oh, only, my only hope is that Tokala says, fuck the dragon, and like, attacks the Roomba. <laughs> I doubt it. Hmm. Where did the Roomba take me? Did it move around? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Right. Hasn't acted yet. Oh god, Kraken's at negative 53? Oh shit! No, that's just because I, I need to fix it. I kept trying to change it to negative 18, and it was like adding negative 18 each time. There's a Roomba up there at negative 278, so you'll, you'll never catch that guy, at least. Yeah. You see, Osman. Float down, get one foot on the floor, and launch into a sprint, running incredibly fast down the hall, right around when he would crash into the side of 
grin, you see him hold up his other hand and wind up a swing with that sword, and he disappears into a unseen dimensional pocket, and Blade dashes through the entire party, because you're all in line. This allows him to take a swing at, let's see, everybody. Everybody will enjoy this single attack, at which point he realized he was about to gamble the entire campaign. <laughs> yeah, see? What if we all took that? Uh. Oh. <laughs> that one's for Ulfred. Uh, Sonic. The same one on everyone. This one's for Tokala. This one's for Luna. Ouch. Another crit. Hey, here's the good news. I don't take any of that Sonic damage. Ulbrin takes 21. That's pretty minor. And Nomcath. And he continues his momentum, backflipping 10 feet away. At least he crit the correct people. Yeah, he was very kind about it, I thought. That was pretty, pretty generous. Uh, let's see. What I was, was to expecting him to crit me and just completely you know, insta death. Yeah. I, well, I was going to be a lazy GM and be like, I'll just roll one for every. Oh, I could kill the That's entire party with one yeah. shot. <laughs> I could kill the whole party. Nah. It says he gets a melee attack. He gets a single attack at each one of you, so. And. Well, still looking pretty good. If he hits you. Um, if he crit you, you get to take down your highest buff of whatever caster level. Yeah, it's going to be your highest level buff. So switch off your highest level buff if he crits you. Let's see. Oh, well that, I guess that's, that's haste. Might be. It's like divine My power, turn. I think. Unfortunate. Yep. Lynn no longer has haste. Uh, oh my god. This is horrible, but I have to. I apologize. Yep. That'll do. You guys see her cast a spell at Tokala, and you see him flicker out of existence for a couple seconds, and then he screams in rage back at her, shaking his chainsaw above his head, and he re-solidifies and stays on this dimension. What Are dimension you... is she going to fling him to? You'll never know. Plane shift his ass? What the fuck? Tokala and Abaddon sending postcards. <laughs> 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 Meanwhile... By the way, Toby, you forgot to do the intimidation <laughs> check when the Tokala attacked. True. We should do that. Boop. Boop. 31. Uh, size affects it. Yeah, she's going to be. She will have resisted it because she's huge. Ooh. Um, Roomba, though. Base. Do you actually have a base on this map? A crowd, and you see the Roomba coming by, and you hear it going. I'm. It clearly, clearly has something stuck in the fan. That uh, can't possibly 
mean anything to a Crodden, right? <laughs> like, there's been a billion bombs going off. Yeah. I don't know. I don't even <laughs> yeah. know if Hardy knows. A natural 20 perception. That would be pretty, that sounds like a half of a cockroach in the wheel. <laughs> Do I even know croc was a like cockroach? A, it sounds like a yes. wingless, legless, polymorph druid dying in a room. <laughs> Unmistakable oh, sound, five. sound. Five. He doesn't think Flash a fucking back. thing of it. Damn, that thing's broken as shit. <laughs> it's headed for its base. Sorry, bud. I want an excuse to infernal healing you. <laughs> no, it's okay. I love this. This is perfect. Captain positioning issues Look, just happens to be where the Roomba goes by. Enrique was so sure that he had already had his most epic death in this campaign. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> but he's, he's gunning for second place now. Death by Roomba. I mean, well, the, yeah. the, the, the sure, choking the tower one... falling on his other character is going to be tough to surpass. Well, he was already... Yeah, it's the best funeral. No, that was yeah. the best yeah. funeral. He was already dead. Yeah, his, his death dead... was pretty dumb there, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it was kind of similar to this, where I just rushed in front of everyone. <laughs> the the, the problem is, at least we, 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 as annoying as Eldrin is, we mostly respected him. <laughs> <laughs> this druid is going to get a is going to get a druid's funeral. In other words, tossed out for the other animal to find. Oh my god! <laughs> oh. oh, we're gonna feed him to the saved your ass like at least once. <laughs> yes. We're gonna feed her to the chipmunks. I think this is what a druid would want. You know, oh, yeah, the chipmunks are gonna like fucking feast on her and be like, finally <laughs> revenge. I believe Castnet was still up when Croctaw was hit for two hundred. I think because I think the yes. Yes. The, the suffocation breath happened right after that. So yes. Cassandali is telling Namkath that Croctaw is dead on the ground down there somewhere, or nearly dead, dying in dire shape. And the Roomba just passed over that area. So Cassandali is perceptive enough. She has a hyper fast intellect as an AI. She saw it and cognates it. Unfortunately, the only person she can tell that to right now is Namkath, and he can't do shit about it. There's a problem. There's a very big fucking dragon in the way, and I ain't doing so good right now. <laughs> Meanwhile. Yeah. I'm not on the cast link. I'm having a very peaceful afternoon. Nobody is anymore. Yes. Oh, I, yeah. I disrupted Numcath. That's the key to bringing down cast link. Okay. I'm going to fucking dump you in the trash like Star Wars A New Hope. The compactor. Shh. Um, at this point, uh, given where we are positioned and what's yeah. going on to yeah. us, party, do we want pro energy? Yes. <laughs> With that blade of his, yes. Olbrin, you have seen very powerful drow magus before. And they can do vampiric touch, they can do frigid touch, but they they do very often do most of their damage with shocking grasp. Okay, then um, you'll have to click it for me, Toby. Oh, yeah. Because um, it, it's switching spells around. Spend a fifth level and then click uh, Pro Energy Communal. Okay. Can do. Uh, spend a fifth level. One. Pro Energy Communal. Badoosh. Okay. And this is Pro Electrical. I'm going to turn on yes. this stuff. Does anybody not have it? That's going to go on on Nomcath. You've got it, right? Boom, it's on it's on Kath. Then we need it on Takala. He did not already have it. I'll put it on him. I've already got it on yeah, I've got it on Luna. Cool. Okay, and then Dealer's Choice Party, do you want me to I can well Damage spells, I can Lightning Bolt or Magic Missile at this point, or I can try to dispel one of their buffs. Do you guys care? Uh, 
Lightning bolt, you'd only be able to hit one person without hitting somebody else. Okay. Um, I mean, magic missile is damage at least. The spell okay. could be pretty good too, though. Yeah. But it just be whether or not it would hit. Yeah. That's true. Remember, Josh, you could also Temporal Divergence multiple Lightning Bolts onto him to see if he fails his save versus one of them. <clears throat> or you could Temporal Divergence multiple Disintergates on him. Now there is that. That's big. Or you could ethereal jaunt and escape. I, I don't have that. That's a mistake. It's I don't actually have that spell. Oh, okay. Okay. I only have one seventh level spell. Really? What is it? Yeah, it's Temple okay. Divergence. That's the only one I have. Okay. Um, I get I get another one next level, but we're not there yet. Yes. Sir. Uh, okay. We're one void dragon and one cybernetic. Uh, uh, drow magus away from that next level, right? <laughs> the dragon yeah. is definitely hurt. Multiple people have gotten a piece of it. Ulfred tore into her. Tokala hit her really hard. Hard enough for her to try to plane shift him into hell or wherever. Luna hit, hit him pretty hard too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Temporal okay. divergence is up. Would you like, uh, are you going to disintegrate or chain lightning intense? What you think? Um, let's, let's do a disintegrate. Okay. A little revenge for now. Go ahead yeah. and do it. Uh, you'll have to spend it as a seventh level because I'm out of sixth. I gave you another point of six, sir. Okay. How do you spell disintegrate? D? D-I-S. So it should be 6 D-I-S. 6 with disc. A, without yeah. the C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think. I'm checking. It's, it's, I thought it was first four letters. Should be just three. Uh, oh, it's, it is. It's 6 D-S, D-I-S-I. 6 D-I-S-I. D-I-S-I. <laughs> Natural right. two misses. Are you aiming at the dragon? Uh, it's, I don't know who I was aiming at. We didn't say. Um, okay, that's you fine. Want, you want to do that again? See if you hit her the second time. Okay. Uh, yeah. That what is your hey dodge. Oh you little freaky lady. She backs around the corner and dodges the second disintegrate. Her touch AC is higher than that, and you are you are on a roll roll low spree a little bit. That was a two yeah. out of five. Okay, so I do nothing. Mm. Careful attack, the bitch. Hmm. Thirty-five miss. Thirty-five miss. 36 is a crit threat, but not a natural 20. It misses. That's sad taste. Oh, uh, and then, of course, I'm going to heal a bit because I forgot to do that. Uh, actually, it looks like, it looks like Luna physically... Okay, no, on, on the light, later attacks. Okay, never mind. And then I'm going to... Spell eat one of my spells. Actually, that whole turn of mine was pointless, Toby. I couldn't yeah. have done any of that. I couldn't Why have not? done any of that. 
Um, because the only reason I was going to do something else is going to use my quick stick, and they have to be third level or lower. I couldn't have done any of those with my quick stick. Well, the so, temporal divergence lets you cast two spells at once. No, but my my actual round was the communal pro energy. Oh, I will put these charges back on you, and I would suggest you try that again because that was just bad luck. Got it. I put so, the charges back. So the only thing I can do is a third level spell. That's why I was asking dispel or lightning or magic mm. missile. That's why I was asking that. Gotcha. Do you have any scorching rays? No. Boo. I would, yeah, I would say magic missile then. Okay. That's Sorry guys. Damage. Sorry, that's why. Totally fine. Missile. Okay. Oh god damn it. Two. Uh -huh. Shooting at the dragon. Fuck that dragon, bitch ho. One thing. Fuck that dragon. As a non-real dragon, she does not have spell resistance, so magic missile just thumps away at her for 30. Your magic missile is hilarious. Uh, okay. Cass. Cass, Cass, Cass. She... You see a little tablet floating out of Nomcast's backpack. And... Let me move this stupid body out of the way, please, Foundry. She floats here, and she unfortunately is definitely revealed to Osman, who yep. Domkath and Ulbren will both see for the first time his head actually moves. He sort of just looks in the middle distance, doesn't ever seem to look at any of you. But when she floats out of Nomcast's backpack, he glares at her, and his eyes glow brighter for a second. And you see a sort of high-speed flicker. And she gets here. And is trying to sense, yes, just on the edge of Roomba range. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And this is going to be... Okay. Barely hits the bug. All allies are healed 50. I will take that. Razors. Including <sighs> the bug stuck in the Roomba. <laughs> <laughs> Put that on Takala. It's weird. It's giving me like a weird menu where I have to select who I'm applying it to. Yeah, I just say yeah. Nickrodden watching a cockroach crawl out of the Roomba. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Well, no, you, you need to go. You need to go water ape in the room, but just boom. <laughs> yeah, and the the was and right. I... All right, fingers crossed that I don't flub this roll. Please roll good. Yes. So. I am dumping. Me, I'm aiming for the dragon. Okay. And I'm also dump. Uh, uh, no, that can't dump that. Unfortunately, damn it! I wanted to dump my uh, 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 my underhanded sneak attack, but she's no. She knows I'm there, so still, I can still roll sneak attack. So, <laughs> seventy-three points of damage, and I am applying the ace, the AC debuff. So she is minus two AC for everybody else and minus six for me. Why are you getting sneak attack? I believe you, but because I post, I spent the last round posting up with the sniper rifle. Oh. To aim. Oh yeah. If it takes multiple rounds to aim, yeah. Totally forget about That's that. That's why I didn't attack last round. <laughs> okay. All right. So this hits. So she takes three piercing because it's Jones' skin. 
And also, uh, one dispel. sneak attack. And I guess we just have to do a caster level check for you. Which is d20 mm, plus what? You can just actually roll uh, 1d20 plus your level. We'll pause at the end of this round because we're over time. 23. 23 minus 11. You get one of her buffs. Not that. Come on, that's my debuff again. <laughs> wow. You sneak attack her with the rifle and land a dispelling shot, and you see the blackness of the dragon sort of shimmer and and flicker and and glare in your direction in rage as her void dragon form fails. <laughs> nice. Oh, I was kind of hoping she was, would have stayed in that square. Uh, yeah. She is quite pissed. That is not, uh, not cool. She says. I think it's very cool. <laughs> Your style is unorthodox. Captain Killsteel moving in. I've heard the enemy is severely wounded and no longer a dragon. I'll just be taking no AOOs as I approach. Do a little flex for the crowd. What's this? A big dick quick stick. Yeah. Nothing left to chance. Not anymore. Yeah. Don't worry, guys. This is how you do it. And you power try quick and true strike. I'll challenge. Fuck it. Oh Hi. my god. Holy <laughs> fuck. Well, I think that bitch is dead. Gentlemen, if you're going to kill Steel, <laughs> do it with style. Fucking spend three rounds doing it and roll a crit. I ran the wrong way. I teleported to the wrong place. I failed a whole person save. I ain't done shit. This lady probably had nine health left. She was still yeah. extremely dangerous. She had 50 health left because she's a beast. And you just crit her for 118. Ooh. A Crodden Ooh. has hated her for years. And he steps around the corner, sees her take a shot, and her awesome Vord Dragon form winks out of existence. And for a moment, she's standing there as a real, normal, extremely cybernetically enhanced woman. And he knows that she's more than capable of shifting right back into Dragon form. Probably would have. And he sprints across the room in his full blade and fucking cuts her head clean off her shoulders. Did we lose Toby? Yeah, we lost him. Yeah, I lost him. I'm here. Here. Oh, we lost. You, you, you're fading in and out a little bit. Oh, you, sorry, cut his, yeah. you cut her head clean, and then that's all we got. Yeah, cut it. her clean off. That's it. That's all he said. Good shot. Dismissed. Dismissed. <laughs> oh. We only have one more combat left to worry about, right? Yeah. That we know I'm of. so dead. The juggernaut. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're still going to have to make a bunch of climb checks to get out of the Roomba. Oh my god. Oh, I thought you were talking to me. I'm like, what? <laughs> no, you're yeah. fine. <laughs> That's what I said. Just ha Climb that. Not <laughs> have him wild shaped to water ape form. Just blow the Roomba up. <laughs> oh, I think I need to battle the Roomba for my he, he slowly glances at your Void Axe as you pass by his 40 plus armor class. Yeah, that, that tracks. <laughs> Divine power was kind of a, an important buff there. Well, Tokala charges him. Gives him the uh, sacred weapon. 46. Hits him and let's see. 
Yeah. He actually hits him and cuts into that black armor. You see strange purple and pink sparks flying off of it as Takala's chainsaw sort of breaks some of its own teeth off on whatever his armor's made of. But he strikes him. He draws blood on Osman. And the last turn of the combat before we pause. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We'll start with Croc Toss heroic. Inside of a Roomba. <laughs> the next session starts inside the bowels of a robotic vacuum cleaner. I'm expecting a custom Roomba map. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> that, next you know, week is a custom one shot. It is Croc and her new friends, the technically compound roaches, attempting to escape the Roomba together. You know, <laughs> you were unconscious punish. when you got sucked up by the Roomba. It might mm -hmm. be kind of odd to wake up and be in a Roomba. Not for her. Yeah. Yeah, you guys <laughs> probably used to this. This is like shit. par for the weirdest fuck course for her. <laughs> okay. Uh, good session, everybody. I think you've got got it well in hand. Totally handled. Yeah, pretty terrifying. Yeah. That was very. Oh boy. <laughs> very oh boy. That's what we're going for. <laughs> very oh boy. Is that the title for this one? <laughs> uh, since I can't figure out how to spell the Roomba noise, yeah. <laughs>